not return to find the land we lost. Threaten was all by Ramat for reaching ground. And gentlemen, gentlemen, uh, gentlemen. Rehearsals, as you can see, are underway for a oh. new production of Chalamot's Hannibal. Monsieur Lefebvre, I am rehearsing. Monsieur Ré, Madame Jury, ladies and gentlemen, uh, Please, if I could have your attention. Thank you. As you know, for some weeks there have been rumours of my imminent retirement. I can now tell you that these were all true, and uh, it is my pleasure to introduce you to the two gentlemen who now own the Opera Populaire, Monsieur Richard Fermin and Monsieur Gilles André. I'm sure you've read of their recent fortune amassed in the junk business. Scrap metal, actually. They must be rich. And we are deeply honored to introduce our new patron, the Vicomte de Chagny. Classic. It's such a cool prize, my dear. It's Raoul. Before my father died, at the house by the sea. I guess you could say we were childhood sweethearts. He called me little Lottie. Christine, he's so handsome. My parents and I are honored to support all the arts, especially the world-renowned Opera Populaire. Picon, gentlemen, Signora Carlotta Giudicelli, our leading soprano for five seasons now. Brava! Signora Ballo Piangi. In honor, Signor, I believe I'm keeping you from your rehearsal. I will be here this evening to share your great triumph. My apologies, Monsieur. Thank you, Monsieur Le Vicomte. Uh, once Lydia. more, if you please, Signor. Love me. Love me. Thank you, love me. Thank you indeed. The one love me. Love me. Love me. Encouraging everybody. He wouldn't recognize me. He didn't see you. If you please, Monsieur. We take particular pride in the excellence of our ballet, Monsieur. I see why. Especially the little blonde angel. My daughter. Meg Giri. And that exceptional beauty. No relation, I trust. Christine Daillet. Promising talent, Monsieur Fermin. Very promising. Daillet, did you say? N -n no relation to the famous Swedish violinist. His only child. Orphan at seven, when she came to live and train in the ballet dormitories. An orphan, you say? I think of her as a daughter also. Gentlemen, if you would kindly stand to one side. 